where you were with the fatigue when we started the program. I was completely exhausted. I, my body was tired. My mind was tired. Just overall, I was tired all the time. It, it didn't matter if I had just woken up. Um, if, if I took a nap during the day, it, it didn't matter what time of day it was. I was just tired 24 seven. In the morning, how did that play out for you? I would think that after sleeping, but I wasn't sleeping very much um, due to the insomnia. So I would think that, you know, okay, well, I just still laying there for a while. I should be rested. I should be okay. And I, I would get up because I needed to get up, not because I wanted to. And so the sleep was not helping you recover. Even if your sleep was slightly better, you wouldn't actually feel better. No, I wouldn't. And would you caffeinate yourself during the day? How would you get through the day? Um, so I don't drink much coffee or I, I was never able to drink like energy drinks, um, but any teas or certain vitamins that were going to give me energy, I was, I was taking that. I was drinking a lot of green tea, a lot of, um, and that would get me to where I do what I had to do. Mm -hmm. And, and that was it. I mean, during the day I'd be working and I, I would just be so tired. Mm -hmm. So you were doing just the minimum to get through the day to finish work and you didn't have energy for anything beyond that. I remember you saying that. My kids used to think as they were growing up, mom has OCD because I was cleaning all the time and I would look around my house and it would frustrate me and it saddened me to see the mess because I didn't have the energy. And, I, and my kids helped, my husband helped, but it, it wasn't the quality that I wanted it to be. Um, and, and, and I just, I would look around and it would, it would depress me on looking around and seeing the mess. And I didn't have the energy to sweep or mop, mm -hmm. energy to wash dishes, you know, put a load to wash. I, I literally, it was work. Um, and because I sat in front of a desk, it wasn't something physical that I had to do. Um, and that was it. And on a scale from one to 10, where would you say your energy was? <laughs> Zero. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, if you can say negative, negative. <laughs> I mean, you said it, it was survival. Zero, one, because I was getting through, you know, a day. But during my lunch, I would go and lay down. I tried to see if I'd fall asleep a little bit or close my eyes. And I, I mean, I didn't even have the energy. To, I would, I just wanted to, you know, lay down and rest because I was just tired. Wow. And where are you in terms of your energy today? Wow. Um, I'm doing overtime. I'm starting at <laughs> six in the morning. I'm working out. I'm, my house is cleaner. <laughs> I just, I have so much more energy now without taking any pills, without taking any, you know, the energy vitamin pills. I are, every so often I might still drink a green tea. Um, I have no caffeine, no nothing to keep me going. It's, it's me. And how has your energy impacted your family? Um, my family sees mom happy. I, I felt like I was just a gloomy thing, just laying in bed and they didn't have like the motivation to, you know, mom doesn't have the motivation. Mom was pushing them or showing them, you know, we're supposed to model for our kids. And they see mom working out. Amazing. I know your daughter is totally crushing it. Yeah, great job. You have been a model for your daughter, I'm sure, in the nutrition department as well. They've yes. been watching you. Yes, they have. Um, you know, they start seeing more of what we're eating and stuff. and to where before they'd be like, eh, that looks gross, or I don't want to taste that, or I don't want vegetables, or, you know, and then they're like, oh, well, maybe this is what's changing mom. You know, in my family, I wasn't taught about health. Yes, we ate home-cooked meals, but the home-cooked meals and the junk that we ate, all of that created the diseases that my family's experiencing. So in order for me to create a different reality for myself, for my health, I had to learn that on my own. You're being a great role model for your family. And it's good to see because we can break that cycle of what we believe is determined by genetics. But actually the way we eat runs in the family, like 
who do we learn it from? From our parents, from our environment, from TV. And so we can absolutely break that cycle um, and get our health back together. And, and I mean, overall, we thought we were eating healthier because we, like you said, we had homemade meals. You know, we'd eat out maybe once a week and it was mainly homemade meals. So we figured we're not eating, you know, fast foods every day to why, why are we feeling this way? And changing our mindset and trying new things. And then you've showed us in cooking classes as well, you know, certain things. And I truly appreciate that because it's completely changed the way, the way we eat and things that we wouldn't even think of eating before. Like if I didn't have that little piece of meat or, you know, something else, we, we still eat meat. Um, it's just smaller portion. We are more full of vegetables and we feel so much better. Mm -hmm.